Right now at 10, a patient assaults the staff at Freighter Hospital, injuring deputies and a health care worker. That sent authorities rushing into the ER this afternoon. Charles Benson is live outside Freighter Hospital with an update on the people hurt. Charles. Sheriff Clark tells us a nurse has facial injuries and two of his deputies have minor injuries. We also talked to one man who was inside during the disturbance. He says it was pretty traumatic. Sheriff's deputies rushed to Freighter's emergency room after reports of a disturbance inside. Art Freming says a nurse helping his wife had just left the room when he heard all the commotion. As soon as she walked out, she was attacked. I looked out and it was our nurse um, and uh, she was screaming. And West Dallas police had dropped off the patient for mental evaluation. Sheriff Clark tells us his deputies used a taser to subdue the man. One deputy was bitten. But they finally got him subdued and uh, they were quick acting. I'll say that. They were right there on the spot, but it was uh, a bit uh, nerve wracking. A 2011 study published by the Emergency Nurses Association says 54% of emergency nurses nationwide reported physical or verbal abuse from a patient or visitor during a seven day period. The number one cause? caring for psychiatric patients. I believe the nurse is okay. I do believe the nurse is okay, but obviously she shook up. Now the hospital says the incident was confined to a small area and was over pretty quickly. No response yet from the West Dallas Police Department on why they brought the patient here for evaluation. We're live at Freighter Hospital. Charles Benson, today's TMJ4. Now we're glad nobody's seriously hurt. Thanks, Charles.